Mind if I come in for a moment? Okay. Now I know it must be a little more than weird being back in the room you grew up in. I mean the whole house actually. I know how I felt when I moved back in with my folks after four years of college. <laughs> a little weird. Yes, it does feel a little different. A lot of things have changed. Well, they certainly have. For the better, I'd like to thank. I mean, your dad? He's in a much better place than when I first met him. And you attribute his improved status to you? Oh, I do, actually, yes. I mean, your dad needed somebody to talk to. He needed a friend. I think he just needed time to get over our mother's death. He was bound to come out of his grief eventually, no matter who was around. Well, look, I, I'm, I'm not suggesting that I was some sort of a miracle worker. I was suggesting anything. I was just stating a fact. Let me ask you, is there any way we can ever be friends? Friends? Well, yeah. I mean, your dad and I are going to have a long life together, and it, well, it would be nice if, you know, we could come to some sort of a positive relationship with his kids. I don't think that's going to be possible. Well, hold nothing back, huh? I'm very straightforward. I don't believe in beating around the bush. You asked me a question, and I responded with the truth. Okay, well, let's keep the tradition of that truth, huh? And why don't you tell me why you don't like me, even though you don't know me? I don't need to know you personally to know who you are. Oh, and who am I? First of all, someone too young to be interested in my dad. Oh, come on. Don't tell me you're hung up on age. Honey, love is ageless. What matters is how two people feel about one another, not the, the level of gray in one's hair compared to the other's youth. I mean, older man, younger woman. It has been a thing since the beginning of time. And most of the time, the younger one is after something. Oh, wow. That's amazing. You don't even know me, and yet you have a world of assumptions rolling through that head of yours. Are you sure this is all about age and not jealousy? What? Yeah. Your dad, Herv, he told me all about, you know, your last couple of boyfriends and how you couldn't hold on to them. My dad discussed that with you? Oh, well, of course, honey. What else are we supposed to discuss when we're lying in the overthrows of passion but the family? That was tacky. Yeah, it was the truth. You know what? I hmm. think I need to get back to unpacking. Yeah, you do that. Thanks for stopping in. Oh, no. The pleasure was all mine. Because now I know where we stand. And I don't have to guess for the rest of our sweet little visit. Actually, you don't know where I stand. But you will. <laughs> That's some sort of a little threat. You'll see. Yeah. Yeah, I guess we will. <laughs>